What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy BT and today we've got this dash cam kit from Fit Cam X right here, baby. Now this project right here is a special one to me. This is the first company that reached out to me basically working to make a prototype for a vehicle that I own. This is going to be put into the Acura MDX. Now in this case, they reached out and for the vehicles that I owned at that time, none of the cameras that they sold would fit that vehicle. So they actually went through the process. I sent them off uh, one of the parts out of the MDX. They went, they made a mold, they sent me a prototype. It was pretty cool to be involved in the release of this product. And now I get to unbox it and install it for you. All right, so here it is right here, the dash cam for the Acura MDX. This is a 4K Ultra HD camera setup here. Reading some of the information on the side here, you've got Wi-Fi connection, loop recording, G sensor, super wide angle, perfect fit, and HDR for high dynamic range. All right, so let's go ahead and unbox this kit here. So inside you can see you've got a dash cam and you've got the accessories here. Uh, slide this out here see what we got in this box so in this box you have a usb 2.0 for your sd card you want to plug that into computer get some data off of there we've got this pry tool in case we need it and here is the harness that we will be using uh, for this particular installation all right, so here we are in the box here. This is the dash cam. Oh, and then we also have a user manual here with all the information that's needed here. They also do have an app that you can download as well for the product. So here, ladies and gentlemen, is the unboxing of the Acura MDX dash cam kit from Fit Cam X. Oh, wow. And that production version is looking pretty good, might I say. Wow. Okay. This, this is looking really good. Wow, man. I love what I'm seeing already. Nice color matched plastics there. Man, thank you FitCam again for taking the time to make a product for Acura MDX owners like myself. So let's go ahead and get this thing installed. All right, you can see here, this is the current setup on the MDX. This is the stock setup right here. So this is where we're gonna be working in this area right here to get the FitCam X installed. All right, so to get this piece down here, right here in the center section where the, the pieces that clips in, like right here, in this spot right here, you're gonna push down on that section right there. So we'll push down on both sides. That allows us to remove this piece right here. All right, so from a wiring perspective, this is what we're gonna be working with right here. So what we're gonna to wanna to do is push on this tab here and slide this connector out. It might be a little tight, but you just push on that tab, use your other hand, slide that out. So now that we have that out, what we can do is take our harness here. We're gonna go ahead and plug this portion of the harness into the jumper piece here. And then we're gonna take this end and we're gonna plug it into the spot where we disconnected the previous one from. Let me get that routed in there and push that in. Okay. All right, so now that that is in place, we take our harness here. If you look here, you have this little indentation there. We're gonna line that up to the piece on the unit, clip that in place, and then we are ready to install. But what I found is just putting this here off to the side, kind of letting the wires stay on the left side should make everything clip in nice and easy. So once that's in place there, uh, sitting up front on the front side, what we'll do is just snap it up and snap it up in place and let everything clip in. Okay. Once you've got everything in place there, you should hear everything snap in. The unit is in and ready to go. So now you can see here the unit is flashing, which means it's actively recording. So now that you can see everything is recording good, make sure you remember to take off your lens cover there. Right here on the side is where the SD card is. I'm actually gonna turn off the vehicle here. So it's gonna stop recording. So it's done recording, everything's good. And the way that you take this out is you actually just push 
on the SD card here. So you can see here, this actually comes equipped with a 64 gigabit uh, micro SD card. So we're gonna go ahead, slide that back in there. And I'm telling you, this unit looks really good. I love the way everything looks here. So to put it in, you just slide it in, press it back until it clicks and you're good to go. But yes, everything is looking good with this unit. You can see here. So here you've got a power button here and you've got a button here where you can take photos. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and get you some, uh, some visuals of what it looks like in the app. All right, so here we are in the FitCam X app. You can see here the LHD designator for the name of the device. We are not currently connected, so we're gonna hit connect. This should pop up your Wi-Fi screen. So look for that same LHD right there. The password should be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You should be able to then connect to the device. So now that we're connected, we can hit the back button, go back into the app, let the app finish up its portion here of getting connected to the device. So now we are connected and as you can see, we do have some, uh, we'll call it remote capabilities right here. You can actually see what is currently being recorded right now on the screen. You can take a photo if you'd like also at the same time, but this is pretty cool here uh, to be able to have this capability with the fit cam dash cam setup. You do have some camera settings here as well that you can also um, select here so yeah we are in business here definitely again appreciate uh fitcam x for building this product for the acura mdx as you can see it looks absolutely amazing during the installation here it's very clean it matches very well looks like a factory finish so yes as mentioned you can see here look at the fit feel and finish of this thing it looks stock so as you can see here i am very pleased with the quality of this product definitely appreciate fitcam x for taking the time to make this product for the mdx i think it is an absolute phenomenal addition to this vehicle. So one of the cool things about having a dash cam is being able to see things virtually through the eye of the driver. So you can see here some of the footage that we have captured here from driving on the road. Uh, this next footage here, not so fortunate, uh, but it's good to have the, 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 the evidence if you need it. So here on the left side, you can see this guy was coming up real fast behind me. He cut somebody off. Then this person, I guess, overcorrected and ended up kind of swerving off of the road. But the good thing is that if there was an accident, you actually will have proof of the footage as to what occurred how it occurred. Now, this is only a front-facing camera, so in an instance where maybe you have a kit with a rear-facing camera, you now have several views to kind of put the story together as to what happened in the incident, especially if you're not at fault. Now, in this next clip here, driving along on the highway, uh, some vehicles dodge a piece of tire. The tire flips up and completely annihilates this Toyota Camry's bumper. Again, all of this is stuff that you get to see through my eyes. And actually, you know, I initially didn't think I would ever need a dash cam, but after using this particular dash cam, man, it is one of those things where, where it's like, it's a must have. It, it's, it's capturing footage that you, you, you basically can't recapture, but with a dash cam, you can absolutely capture it. Now in this situation, another unfortunate one, I think maybe this driver fell asleep at the wheel, ended up braking, and then merging over into the lane of the truck. Uh, luckily, it wasn't a high-speed accident. It was a, a fairly low-speed one. The truck was able to stop, and hopefully everyone was okay in that situation. So you also get to capture things like a bunch of Cybertrucks getting delivered to a Tesla dealership. But at the end of the day, again, dash cam, dash cam, dash cam. Can't talk enough about how amazing it is to have a dash cam in the car while you're driving it's your boy bt thank you for checking out this video and i'll catch you guys on the next one